Hey, what's going on everybody? Nick with Renowned Reptiles here. In today's video, we're gonna check out some of my pets, which are two retics. I have other pets, but today, we're just featuring the retics. So, in my hands here, I have a Sunfire Golden Child from Prehistoric Pets. I got him in the auction in Pomona in January. Um, really happy with this guy, great temperament, and just really happy to have him on board. I'm gonna see if I can get this on camera, but he has an awesome head stamp, which I think is pretty typical for the golden child, golden child gene. And he's a squirmy little guy like all retics, but let's see if we can get the camera to zoom in. And s there we go. Look at that, perfect cross right on his head. Beautiful, beautiful animal, great disposition and uh, not head shy at all and I really like holding him because he moves constantly. He is a shaker and a mover um, but not aggressive at all. It's pretty easy to get him out of food mode and he's ready to go. Now the next retic that I'm going to show not so much. She and I have a love-hate relationship in that I love her and she hates me so this retic's name is Irwin in honor of the Irwin family and the retic that hates my guts her name is Bindi. She just ate her first three pound rabbit, uh, which I will show you in this clip. So if you're a little squeamish, go ahead and skip out after I'm done talking here. Um, but I'll show you her eating the three pound rabbit. And of course, once they eat, they, they poop. So I have to clean it up. Um, so I will show you how I get her out. She's usually not bad once I get her out. Um, I put her into a holding bin and then I clean her cage, it's for some reason, whenever I go to take her out of the holding bin, she's fired up, mouth open, and pretty much ready to kill me. So the trick is getting her back in the cage. So without further ado, let's check out my beautiful um, Lavender Tiger retic from El Segundo Pythons, smashing her first three pound rabbit, and then the cleanup job and what that entails getting her out of the cage. And before we check out the next part of this video, with me probably getting close to getting tagged by a very large retic. Um, I want to give a huge shout out here to Beach Bum Exotics. My man Adam down in Southern California holding it down for the lower half. Um, he's an awesome dude, great, great guy, huge part of Reptiles Unplugged. He is the other half of the channel, um, so it's him and Joel. I'll put all of Adam's description in the link below. Without further ado, let's check it out. All right guys, so I need to get this retic from here to here. Doesn't seem that crazy, right? Because I need to clean up that, the remnants of the three pound rabbit. So let's see how she's doing and what kind of mood she is in today. Let's go, wish me luck. time for a bigger a hook. This one's starting to get a little bend to it. Alright. And she's out. This is Bindi. How long do you think she is, babe? Too long. <laughs> no, okay, you think she's 10 feet, 12 feet? Um, probably 12. Yeah, she's, she looks like two of me now. Yeah. Alright, so the trick is getting her to go in her tub. That part's usually pretty easy. It's getting her out that's the issue. So now we gotta get this cleaned up. Check it out. You know what I forgot, babe? What? The trash can. <laughs> Gloves. That might be helpful. The essentials. <laughs> I guess we're going in. You're gonna go in barehanded? I'm just gonna roll it up like a little burrito. Should be able to get it out to the trash can.
All right, guys, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Um, we've had a lot of new subscribers lately. I'm so thankful for all of you. Thanks to the OGs who subscribed right when I first started the channel. Thank you to anyone new who just joined. I am trying to post more content for you guys to watch. Um, I'm really amazed and happy that any of you are watching these videos. Um, I feel very blessed to hang out with some of the people in the community that I get to hang out with and experience and see some of the animals um, that we get to see. So on behalf of uh, Erwin and I here, a huge, huge thank you to all of you who are subscribing and watching these videos that I've been posting. And please let me know what kind of videos you'd like to see in the future. Uh, I'd love to keep you entertained. So thanks for watching. Until next time, take care. <laughs>